So enjoy life. Take every opportunity you can to be crazy, to be spontaneous, to have fun, and to value each other and respect each other. And value the time that you have together and evangelize by continuing to share the love that you have today to everyone that you come in contact with. I want to show you how I feel My love, it's my heart that you steal And I can't help falling, falling, falling for you Danielle, today is the day I've been waiting for my whole life and the last three years. <laughs> Through the years I've seen how strong you are and I know how proud your mom would be of the woman that you have become. I can't wait for the day that you become the mother of our children. Here is due forever and I can't wait to call you my wife. Love, <laughs> Mike, and I'm not reading what it says at P.S. <laughs> Happy wedding day! Almost seven years ago, you asked me to be your girlfriend, and three years ago, you asked me to be your wife, and today, finally, we're getting married! You mean the absolute world to me, and I can't wait to marry you today and spend the rest of our lives together and see what the future holds for us and have babies and grow old together and I appreciate your constant love and support and you are the best thing that ever happened to me. So I will see you at the altar later and I love you. You shine brighter than the stars in the sky. I am yours and I know you are mine. You're the one I want to be next to. I want to live in that. My love, you shine so bright. Relationships are strengthened under stress, tragedy, and loss. Outside forces will push and pull on your bond. Tragedy and loss test a relationship, and there has already been great loss by evidence and missing family members here today. As my cousin mentioned, I lost my mom when I was 18 to cancer 10 years ago this September, and she could not be here with us today. When my mom knew she didn't have much time left, another thing she had to have known was the amount of love I would continue to be surrounded by when she left. A mother's love is unconditional Yet so many people around me have done one hell of a job to try and fill that void. Mikey, I wish you could have met my mom because I know that the two of you would have been the best of friends. I don't think she would have left me if she didn't know I was in the best of hands. Again, thank you all for being here with us, not just today, but always. You mean the world to us, and we cannot wait to spend the rest of the night with you. I'll be there standing by your side, hand in hand, walking through this life. I want to spend all of our days. You may kiss the bride. One of our 
most memorable childhood memories with Danielle is the day Danielle and her mom came to our door right after I was diagnosed with juvenile diabetes at the age of eight. And Danielle hands me a letter. So I open it and it says, Mackenzie, I love you. You are my best friend and I hope you're not gonna die. <laughs> Surprised, I look up, we start laughing. What was I going to do, right? For those of you that truly know Danielle, know that once she has made her mind up about something, she completes it. And that's why, even though it is a year later, we are all gathered here to celebrate the love between Danielle and Mikey. Danielle, I cannot even imagine the smile your mom has on her face right now. I can see her standing at your kitchen island, wearing one of her Bonton sweaters that she had in every color, and messing with her e seasonal angel figures. <laughs> Mikey, you have this demeanor about you and the way you treat Danielle that reminds you of my aunt's personality. You make her so happy, the kind of happiness that all of us who knew her before you came along prayed she would find. And I want to thank you for being that person for her. I know she's been waiting for this uh, moment for a very long time. In fact, I know a lot of us are. Uh, from day one, you got along with my family and it didn't take long for you to become everybody's favorite. As far as uh, being there for Mikey, you couldn't have done a better job. Um, you're there for him anytime he's sick. You're there for him anytime his sugar's low. And you're there for him every time his dad fires him. On a more serious note, I'm honored to be standing up here as your best man. And I'm more honored to watch you grow into the amazing person you become. I feel very fortunate to be here representing Mike today on this big night. Uh, Mike and I are separated by five days and quite literally every milestone in my life Mike has been an important part of and vice versa. Mike's more of a brother to me than he is a cousin or a friend and I'm proud to be here today. Uh, if, if you're sitting in one of these chairs tonight, I probably don't have to tell you what an amazing couple this is. Danielle was family to me long before tonight. Uh, raise your glasses in the air for Mr. and Mrs. Michael DiMaria. Maria.